Hey everyone, BDM Lives, hope you guys are well, hope you guys are good. Alhamdulillah, first of all, all praises to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the Almighty, the All Knowing, the All Seeing. You know, I'm back, I'm back at home, I'm back with my family. Alhamdulillah, all praises to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. As I always say, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the best of planners and He plans everything for you. So, you know, never complain of um, the situation or the circumstances that you're going through. When you're going through a hard time, difficult time, always praise Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and say, Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, Rabbi Allah, and all praise to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, you know. Um, I went to Pakistan for two months, but uh, with the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, I ended up spending almost five and a half months at Pakistan, almost six months, let's call it six months, you know, but Alhamdulillah, you know, I had a great time there, I enjoyed myself at Pakistan, um, I've done so much, you know, so much stuff, there was so much stuff going on, you know, I've done Eid al Fitr there, you know, I've done Ramadan there, I've done vlogging on the motorcycle, the motorbike there, you know, um, the first two, three weeks we vlogged um, with my brother LA, we went down, we done all over Pakistan, you know, whatever we could get in, we got in for you guys, but Alhamdulillah, you know, we had a fantastic time, I had a great time at Pakistan, you know, all my viewers, just want to say a big thank you to all my viewers, all my subscribers, my viewers were messaging me, texting me, getting in contact with me through social media and asking me, you know, BDN, are you alright, BDN, do you need anything, BDN, when you're coming back, you know, Everyone was worried, everyone was concerned. So Alhamdulillah, you know, I really appreciate um, your help, you appreciate your support. Um, just shows that I have a really strong fan base and I was getting a lot of messages and a lot of, you know, appreciation by people. So it's all good, you know, it's all good, baby, baby. But anyways, as I said, all praises to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. I'm back now. Um, I'm in my front room. I'm gonna make this into an office soon. So I'm gonna show you guys um, In a couple of weeks, you know at the moment obviously everything now. This is what you guys gotta understand It's a 14 day self-isolation. So I gotta stay home 14 days and isolate Self-isolation for 14 days. So I can't go out. I can't be vlogging when I'm out um, I can't go out. You know, I don't need to go out. So I'm gonna stay home Stay safe, keep my family safe, and most important, keep our country safe. So this was just a quick, you know, message um, for you guys. You know, just a quick, you know, just to let you guys know that I'm back. I'm back safe, and Alhamdulillah. Now, Inshallah, with the will of Allah Subhanahu wa Taala, I will be starting um, my uh, business um, venture. Um, I will be starting merchandising soon. Um, you know, I'm going to start doing nice designs and clothing with the BDN vlogs. Simple logos, but then obviously I'm going to be doing more exclusive stuff where I'm going to be have like cartoon characters of myself with burgers or, you know, chips or, or anything. Taking a big bite with a cartoon character with a big bite written on top. Or, you know, with my special slogan, the oi, 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 oi. Or like you know whatever I'm doing I'm gonna be doing something you know I'm gonna be doing exclusive designs. obviously the basic designs are gonna be on a basic price and the exclusive designs are gonna be one-off so I'm not gonna be doing big production just limited stuff so I'm gonna be starting off with the masala shot as well soon inshallah for the masala shot it's gonna be a shot cup um, it's gonna be a 50 ounce masala shot now how this works is when you're cooking a curry um, you know, you got to put your spices in and the ratio of this and that and blah, blah, blah. But with the masala shot, you're going to be getting the wrong chef experience. You're going to be getting my experience of my flavors and how I cook. So the masala shot's going to have, you know, it's going to have its own spices in there. The only thing you need to do is you need to fry the tomatoes and the onions, the ginger, the garlic, fry that up and just put the masala shot in, boom, add the chicken, add the meat, add the dal, add the sabzi, vegetables, whatever you want to cook, you just add that shot in. Now one shot, one masala shot covers um, at least, um, I would say a kilo and a half to two kilos of meat, chicken or whatever, you know, 
um, it's, it's more or less about kilo to two kilos so if you're cooking a kilo of meat you can put a masala shot in there if you're cooking a kilo and a half two kilos kilo and a half you can put that masala shot if you're putting two kilos in it still covers it up to two kilos you can cook with one masala shot now this masala shot is going to be all dry masala they're going to be my personal recipe you know my personal masala which you know you just need to add it to the andi and just cook it dry it out and bang you're going to have the wrong chef experience so here you know i'm here now i'm going to start doing things a lot of people are requesting you know like they want to have the wrong chef experience they want to cook they want to try my food they're going to do so much so I'm going to be providing with you guys, you know, with the masalas. All you need to do is, as I said before, you just add this shot, boom, into the andi, job done. Only thing you need to add is the tomatoes, the onions, and the fresh ginger garlic, you know. But Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, all praises to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. I'm on a 14-day um, isolation, so I'm going to be sticking to the rules. And, you know, I'm back. I'm going to turn this room into an office. In a few days, you know, my brother's going to go and get the stuff or whatever and we're gonna start making an office here start doing things inshallah i've got a few other people um i've got a few people that want to work with me obviously i'm not going into the music industry people want me to do music videos and stuff but what i'm gonna do is i'm just helping a few mates out you know who want to make a few do a few tracks and stuff or whatever but it's gonna help them out, edit the films for them and maybe film for them but see what happens in the world is your oyster as they say so i'm back now alhamdulillah all praises to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala the almighty the all-knowing now you guys you guys need to stay safe and keep safe as i always say you know just follow the guidelines provided by your governments you know whatever your government says just follow the guidelines it's really simple you know keep your distance two meter distance don't shake hands don't hug don't go into crowds keep your hands clean keep sanitizers with you you know sanitize your hands and just wash your hands and that's it like this you're going to keep your family safe yourself safe everyone safe you know your home safe and you know that's it you know you need to stay humble um another message i want to give out everyone is you know just be humble you know be real be true you know and be humble um you know help out your family if your brother your sister your niece your nephew your mom dad or cousin anyone is going through a hard time or anyone is struggling you need to be helpful you know you need to help your family you need to help your loved ones you need to be humble there's a lot of people out there which are on social media or whatever a lot of people come on youtube or instagram or whatever and people like you know people got so much time where they just want to swear at people and you know say bad words and bad you know bad things to people which you don't even know there's no point you know in doing this there is no point at all i don't know what people get out of this but there is no point just be a humble person you know be a true muslim you know if you want to impress someone impress allah subhanahu wa ta'ala the almighty you know he is the creator of everything it's allah subhanahu wa ta'ala who created you who created us who created everything and it's he who we come from and remember it's he who we shall return to so for that reason you know don't go on like you know go on sick or a bad man because that's not gonna get you anywhere in life you know just gonna give you an example look at fair on you know in his time he was the he claimed he was the god you know he was everything he had everything but look in the end even he died he returned to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala you know so he was the biggest you know people are going on like the gangsters or the bad mans but remember Fir'aun was the biggest gangster ever and look what happened to him you know so just be humble be nice be good be respectful respect everyone you know speak to people how you want to get spoken to and most important thing speak to your mom and your dad in a respectful manner speak to your elders in a respectful manner just be respectable to everyone don't be negative be positive if you want to be successful if you want to do um, good in life and if you want to impress the almighty Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala just be humble be truthful and just you know be real alhamdulillah so as i said i'm back i'm back home with my family my mom my brothers my sister you know i'm here with everyone alhamdulillah it's great to be back all praise to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as i said the time i spent in pakistan was amazing it was the best time ever 
the best time ever in my life in Pakistan you know I love Pakistan you know I love Pakistan with that passion you know I have a big 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 you know space in my heart for Pakistan Pakistan is motherland Pakistan is my motherland it's our motherland it's your motherland you know we are Pakistanis I come across a lot of people a lot of children that go really negative about Pakistan they say we hate Pakistan Pakistan is this and Pakistan is that most of them have not been to Pakistan you know and when you ask them the question like um, what about your dad is your dad oh yeah my dad's a Pakistani um, what about your mom my mom's a Pakistani so how can so that means if you hate Pakistan you hate your mom and dad do you know what I mean it doesn't matter where you are what you are there's good and bad everywhere in the world you know but as I showed you guys if you check my 2018 vlogs out and 2020 vlogs out Pakistan is the most beautiful country in the world you can go and check my inspiration the guy whose footsteps I'm walking in Lord Alim you know check his vlogs out and look how he showcases Pakistan Pakistan is the most beautiful country in the world you get bad people good people everywhere in the world you know so this is our motherland this is our roots I'm a Pakistani you know I am British born some people always say I'm British born or I'm German I'm born in Germany or I'm born in France or I'm American I'm not Pakistani but remember our roots our background we are from Pakistan we need to be proud to be a Pakistani you know this is our Pakistan this is our country this is our motherland you know Pakistan is our motherland this is where our mother and father have come from so we need to you know be proud to be Pakistan if you haven't got anything good to say about Pakistan don't say anything bad you know there's a lot of people that got a lot of negative stuff to say about Pakistan so just don't say anything you know if you want to say something about Pakistan say Pakistan Zindabad long live Pakistan you know Pakistan is the greatest country in the world Pakistan has a strong culture in the Pakistani culture is very strong if you can go to the different areas the different cities just gotta expand out a bit and boom it's got a, such a strong culture that you know I don't think any other place has that strong culture you know the foods in Pakistan if you go to Pakistan and check the foods out oh my god the foods are amazing the street foods you know the foods and the rainy and the carts then you got the street foods on the you know food streets then you got the restaurants then you got the village food then you got the normal traditional food there's so much foods but you could go all over Pakistan and the food is just number one you know this is one of the main reasons I travel out to Pakistan is to enjoy the food you know I think that Pakistan has the best food in the world you know Alhamdulillah long live Pakistan Pakistan is in the bad may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless our country and bless Pakistan you know and bless all of you who are viewing Alhamdulillah all praises to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala almighty you know I just want to say a big 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 thank you to my subscribers you know love you guys really appreciate your time your support you know your effort it's you guys that keep me going it's you guys that are building my channel it's you guys that are building my viewing time alhamdulillah I would not be here without you guys really appreciate it you know love you guys you know it's just you know can't do this without you guys so you know my channel is growing so just get on subscribing for the guys now who have not subscribed but are viewing just want to say a big thank you to you guys for viewing but you have not subscribed so you need to hit the subscribe button and welcome aboard on PDN Nation and join the PDN family and let's grow this channel together you know Alhamdulillah I'm starting my merchandising up soon I'm going to start my masala shots up soon I've got so much stuff going on you know we're going to do this together so just subscribe and hit the bell icon so you get notified and you know just watch out for the notification and PDN vlogs 2020 is going to be our year inshallah all praises to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala all praises to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala the almighty the all knowing alhamdulillah alhamdulillah rabbil alameen